Kelsey and today's video is going to be my May favorite and it feels like this month has just flown by. I feel like just yesterday I uploaded my April favorites but it's not. It's the end of May and I'm going to sit down and film my favorites video for this month. So with that being said, let's jump right in. Alright, now as for beauty favorites this month, I have a few beauty favorites, but as for makeup, I only have one makeup favorite this month, and that goes to the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Eyeshadow in Amber Rush. This eyeshadow is to die for. It is the prettiest shadow I have ever seen. It is so pigmented, and I just love the color of it. I think it is beautiful for the spring and the summertime. It's kind of a bronzy gold, and I really like wearing bronzes and golds, especially in the summer. And that is actually my only favorite for makeup this month. I didn't really try out any other makeup favorites, um, so that's the only favorite that I have. But moving into skincare, I have a few skincare products. The first one I want to talk about is the Aveeno Clear Complexion Foaming Cleanser. And I don't know if I've mentioned this in a, uh, another favorite of mine, but I used to use this um, at like the end of last year or the fall of last year. And then I ran out of it and I never rebought it. I purchased something else. And my sister actually got this for her and I just started using it again in the shower. And I really like this stuff. I have noticed a difference in my skin. Um, it's become even clearer and more radiant to me. And I love this stuff. I love the way it smells. I love the way it makes my skin feel. And I'm really glad that I have started to uh, use this product. Alright, moving on to, I don't know if you would consider this skincare or body care, but it's a body wash. And it's from Bath & Body Works. And it is in the scent Sea Island Cotton with Shea and Vitamin E. And I love Bath & Body Works shower gels. I really just haven't used anything else the past uh, few months because of this stuff. This smell, or the smell of this is very just fresh and clean. Moving on to another Bath & Body Works uh, skincare, body care favorite. Uh, this is the Hawaii Coconut Body Lotion. And this is in their like summer collection last year, I believe. And I got it in... I have been using it a lot here lately. I use it every time I shave my arms and my legs and stuff at night when I get out of the shower. I'll just rub this on my legs and my arms and um, I just love the way it smells. It smells like just coconut in summer and uh, I love it. Alright, now that is actually all to my uh, beauty care, skin care, body care, whatever. So yeah, I didn't really venture out and try anything different besides the couple things that I've shown you. So now we're going to move on into some random favorites. And to start off, I have a candle. This candle is Tropical Coconut, and this is not a Bath & Body Works candle. It looks like a Bath & Body Works candle. It smells like something from Bath & Body Works, but it's actually from a local grocery store that I have here. Um, some of y'all may know of Kroger, if you don't, it's just one of my local grocery stores. I picked this up last summer, and I didn't really burn it because I picked it up at the end of the summer, and then I was changing my candles for the fall, but anyways, um, I picked this up, and this recent past month, I have been burning this in my room, and I just love the smell of it. It's very just tropical and coconutty, and it smells like summer, and it makes me happy when I burn it because I just smell summer and I'm so excited for summer so yeah I got this and I'm very shocked that it looks like a Bath & Body Works candle but it's not fooled you all right now on to food favorites and food favorites have definitely been banana chips and if you don't know what banana chips are go to your local grocery store go to a farmer's market go somewhere where you can get some because they are delicious it's like a piece of banana that's been dried up it's got the like crunchiness of a chip and the sweetness of a banana so it's kind of like a crunchy candy that's healthier for you and i don't have any with me because literally this morning i just finished the package that i had then went to church and threw away the package so i don't have that the package of my banana chips but mine are just organic from my local grocery store. Right, now moving on 
to, I guess we'll just go into favorite app of the month. And my favorite app of the month has definitely been Spotify. And I recently got Spotify. I never was really into Spotify. Um, I just didn't get what, like, what it was. So I decided, you know what, I'm just going to download Spotify because I'm just going to see what it's about. And I am obsessed. I don't think I will ever download another song from iTunes. I have already deleted all the music that was in my music folder tab. And I am just using Spotify now because I get any song that I want basically for free. You just put it in a playlist and I love it. And if you don't have Spotify, I recommend it. Um... I like it. I think it works great. That leads me right along into music favorites. And if you want to know any of my music favorites, I'm actually going to be making a playlist dedicated to my music favorites of May. So I think I'm going to start doing that for every monthly favorites. And if you like that, give this video a thumbs up and I will link it below so that you can go and listen to some of my favorite songs for the month. And just to let y'all know, Spotify is free. All right. Now, my favorite TV show this month has definitely been, oh, well, I have two. Okay, I was getting excited, but I have two. My first favorite is Vampire Diaries. Can we all just take a moment? For that season finale this month, I was sitting in my room. I didn't have a chance to watch it on TV. So I was sitting in my room, watching it on the CW website, and I was bawling my eyes out. I was crying, and if you have not seen the season finale, I'm not going to ruin anything for you. You need to go and watch it. And if you have never seen Vampire Diaries, trust me, you'll love it. It is so good. So just drama-packed, just... Oh, I love it, and I'm not going to ruin anything or spoil anything, but I was falling and I was crying, and you just need to go watch it. That was one of my favorite shows this month. Then another one is another one that I'm starting on Netflix, because we all know last month I finished, was it last month? Last month I finished 90210, and I was a little upset because I've already watched Gossip Girl, I've already watched 90210, what do I need to watch next? So I was asking some friends at my work and asking some friends around just saying you know what would you recommend on Netflix so one of my friends she recommended One Tree Hill and I didn't really know much about that show I don't even remember like seeing it when it came on TV it's not on TV anymore the series has finished it has like I believe like eight or nine seasons I may be wrong and I am in love with that show Chad Michael Murray is gorgeous and I just love that show. I think that it is such a cute show. And I actually have a favorite movie this month. And this is a Disney Channel movie. I love Disney Channel movies. I think they're just cute and corny. And who doesn't love Disney Channel movies? So my favorite Disney Channel movie of all time is Geek Charming. And if you have not seen that movie, it is with Sarah Hyland and Matt Prokop. Prokop? I don't remember. I don't know how to say his last name. It's her hus boyfriend, husband, fiance, whatever. I just love that movie. It's just a cute little show. It's about a geek who shoots this movie for the popular girl at school and they end up falling in love and I just love that movie. It's just such a cute little movie and I've been watching it nonstop on Netflix and I just love that movie. It just makes me so happy. So yeah, that is my favorite movie for the month of May. Now, I think that is actually all of my favorites this month. Um, it's kind of a short video, I know, so sad, but I plan on trying out a few more things in June, hopefully, because I plan on going on a shopping spree sometime in June, so be on the lookout for a haul for makeup favorites. I'll actually have makeup favorites because it seems like the past two or three of my favorites video I have not had any makeup favorites so sorry about that but don't worry hopefully by the end of next month when I upload a June favorite I will actually have makeup favorites that reminds me I have one big announcement to um, tell you guys I have decided to make a vlog channel and if you don't know what a vlog channel is it is basically where people kind of have a camera on them throughout their day and they just you just follow them around in their daily life. I am obsessed with vlogs um, and vloggers. My favorite is 
Ciao Bella or Megan on YouTube. That's her beauty channel, but she has a blog channel, La Vida de Meg. I'll link it below so that y'all can go watch it. I love her vlogs. They're like 20 minutes long, and it's just you just sit there and you just follow her around. So it kind of inspired me to start a blog channel of my own, and I have decided to create one, and I have already created it. It is Kelsey Elizabeth Vlogs is the title of the name. I'll link it below. I really hope that you will go and check out my channel. And yeah, that is all I think I'm going to talk about today. I hope you all have a wonderful day and a wonderful rest of the week. And I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye, guys.